What if you had to take the place of a top secret agent? Could you do it? That's the question that's really at the heart of Double Vision. Uh, Link is a regular kid and he's gotten into trouble and these um, top secret agents show up at his doorstep and they say, you look just like this agent of ours that's missing called Benjamin Green and we'd like you to take his place and we'll make all your troubles go away. So Link agrees and he goes to Paris to find this top secret painting with mysterious powers. Only Link quickly finds out that everybody has an agenda, including Pandora, this agency he's supposed to be working for, and Benjamin Green is not quite missing, and then there are bad guys on his tail, so he's running all over the place and still trying to find his painting. Plus, he has to decode these ciphers that are very complicated. I grew up in the Netherlands, and I've been fortunate enough to have taken a few trips to Paris, so I know quite a bit about the city, and I had a great deal of fun uh, researching all the locations, including the Louvre and the catacombs. There's just so much history there and so many stories to tell. Double Vision is very much a contemporary novel, and I wanted it to have that thriller feel and to have the stakes that matter today, and for us not to simply stop at the Louvre because it had a great story, but to stop at the Louvre because that's where the story was happening for Link. My website has a lot of information for kids that are interested in uh, Secret Agent Life beyond the book. There are links to uh, the NSA, the CIA, and to the International Spy Museum with codes and ciphers and games and lots of fun stuff to do um, for, to keep you excited until the next book. A lot of the time the kids that say they don't like to read, they love to watch a movie and they like to play video games and those media are, all have stories in them too just like books. So I think sometimes it's just about the right book and I'm hoping that Double Vision is that right book that gets kids to read that might ordinarily not pick up a book and flip through it and at the end of it go, I can't wait for Link's next adventure.